I'm going to unfold a fantastic adventure in my playthrough of Paper Mario. Thank you for watching me reminisce my childhood. Have a great day and enjoy. I just came back from getting a very nice uh, 10 a.m. breakfast. I woke up at 8.30 in the morning and now I'm making videos exclusively about Lincoln Logs. This is my final video ever. I'm kidding. My name is Brian Saviano, a.k.a. Bricks O'Brien. So, uh, let me, let me, not to you. I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to you. Oh, it's you, Mario. What a fortunate timing. I had a dream last night and another oracle spoke to me. Its voice was heavenly. Oh, great. If you keep going around around the red palm tree in the distant desert. Oh, something good will happen. So said the voice in my dream. Okay. So, well, I won't be doing that because we already left the dry, dry desert and I apparently didn't see anything that was good in there in the first place. So, yeah, uh, I, we're going to continue, obviously, our Paper Mario adventures here. I want to see what, uh, what what's going on here with uh, our various partners and whatnot, see if there's any mail or anything like that. Um, these are all different little... Uh, you know, additional story things you can take a look at and uh, read if you like to. Uh, I don't know if there's any benefit to some of them, but, you know, adds a bit more story context to the game. So, yeah, uh, that's a thing you can do. And I know I just checked the badges before I left the last time, but want to quadruple check. There's nothing I want. Cool. So, we just did... We did the toy box. What's next? I kind of forget. After the toy box, you go not to the moon. That's in the next game. Um, you know, oh, we go to Key Hall Key, but not Key Hall Key. It's whatever it's called um, in the in the first game. The island. We're going to the island, and I remember that because I see water. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, cool. So now, how do we get to the mystical island of wonders? I I don't know. I I forget. So uh, clearly, we're not going toward. The north here. Is there anything to the south of this area? I forget, you know? I'm just taking things as they come. We've already been down that way. You don't need to go down that way pretty much ever again. We still need to find this section here. Uh, we need one more, which I, I think is on the island. I don't know where else it would honestly be, but uh, we already went toward that way for the spooky area. Okay, I believe there is a dock down this way that we haven't gone to. And there's stuff to do down in the uh, sewers as well, right? Yeah, so w let's go into the sewers here because there is that other section. I don't know if you guys and girls remember because it's all coming back to me now after not playing this game for two days. Is um, There is a section where it's a concrete block and this little thing right over here too. So it's a couple things new that we can access down this way here. So blooper, oh, it's a blooper fight. Isn't that fantastic? Okay, cool. So now we can probably take care of this guy a bit easier now that we have uh, some more power on our side here. Obviously, Spook is not going to work here. I don't think you can actually scare him away, even if you wanted to. So, yeah. And you're going to ink. There we go. I blocked it. Wow, I blocked it. I can't believe I did that. All right. And you clearly can't do any hammer-type moves on him here. So it's basically just... Rinse and repeating this over and over again here. So, and we should get another level up after this, too. I don't know what I want to go for. Maybe it'll be a, uh... Oh, you're going to poop out a Oh, no, you don't poop out a little one. I thought he might have. But, uh, clearly no uh, pooping of small, uh, little, uh, blooper today. So, um, I don't know what I would upgrade next. You know, a hearts I feel like we're doing okay with. But I feel like that's the most always needed or necessary of any of them, you know? Um, oh, and that actually got rid of the lightning. That That's actually very good, too. So that's a, a good way to make sure he's taken care of. Is he done? No. Okay, cool. I'm like, there's no way after, like, two turns he's done. So we still have that, uh, that power reduction on, so we're taking even less damage still. So, you know, and I was also thinking while not recording the series, I'm like, you know what? I think this game overall is just very easy. Um, I'm not sure if it's just now that I know how to play the game itself instead of being a 
for lack of a better term, a dumb kid who doesn't know, like, how the mechanics of the game work. I, I really rushed through things and didn't think a lot of things through properly with the game. But this entire game has been super easy so far. So it's mostly just been me on autopilot trying to, uh, you know, get as much stuff as I can. Um, we'll go with the HP. We'll go with HP, FP, then uh, badges once again. So uh, here is a great little area where you can uh, magically teleport to new areas. Uh, that's what all of those warp pipes there are for. They are not just for show. So you can go back to other areas that you would otherwise need access to again. Um, or at least you want to fast travel uh, to those areas. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't know what else is down here. Oh, there's these guys. Okay, great. Awesome. Um, I'm going to not. There we go. Just going to avoid all them because we faced off against them before, I think. Finally, I've been looking for that Power Smash badge for like 7,000 years. Give me this. Where is it? It's back up here. Yes. Thank you. Wow. Why did that take so long? It has the same effect as Power Jump. It, it, it uses more power. Like, you have more power when you're doing that. So, I don't know why they wouldn't give that to me. Actually... I've never faced off against one of these guys here, is what I'm remembering. Uh, one of them was inside of a, uh, like a, a box, and I never actually hit the box, so. But look, it does six damage, like, that's great. That's awesome. And like here, they don't even give us any, uh, star points at all. So, at this point, it's like, hey, you know, whatever. Um, I'm half tempted to just skip the battle for saving time, you know what, yeah. Let's just run away, whatever, <laughs> because we got, we got, you know, nothing else to do down here, so. Oh, and it actually didn't, uh, take up any of, uh, the coins there. Huh. Cool. Alright. So. Oh, I probably need Paricari. Paricari. Oh, definitely can't go that way. Okay. That's a hammer that, uh, is probably, the, it is the next hammer we're gonna get in this, uh, lineup here, so. Let me just make sure I can't... Oh, I can jump on here. Okay. We'll do this. Go... Oh, that's not it. Okay. I will try it again. I, do... I don't even know if it's anything valuable that's over here, but you never know. Okay. Clearly, that didn't work. There we go. Anything good over here? Maybe. Let's try doing this. Because I'm assuming that's what we need to do. Yeah, it is. Still haven't found a use for the star pieces so far. I know that they, uh, there's a section, oh great, around here, but. There we go. Yeah, I'm definitely running away from that one. Don't, don't care about that at all. If you're doing one damage to me at this point, whatever. So I'll, uh, make my way back up to the surface and, uh, figure out where else we can go that's interesting. What about right here? What's down here? Anything good? No, we got to turn into a boat right here. Or no, we need um, a Sushi, I believe is his name, in the uh, next area. That's where we're going to get him. So I'll, uh, I'll find the port and figure out what exactly or where exactly we go about doing this now instead of wasting, not wasting time, but, you know, not using our time as effectively as we can. How about, how about that word, phrasing there? Yeah. All right, so I think it's down this way here. Yes, it is. The first time approaching the docks over here. So, I'll save just for the sake of saving. You never know. And, uh, I, you know, I don't know where the actual uh, guy is. There's a little fish right there. Well, that's cool. Hey, you. An odd fellow has been hanging around port lately. All he does is stare out to the horizon and mumble about treasures and the like. Look, he's here again today. Where? Oh, there he is. Hello. Hmm, who, who am I, you say? Why, my dear chap, I'm none other I know who you are. We just met you. Like, a little while ago. Do you not remember? Uh, I think now Colorado, how to cross the sea? Okay. Uh, sir? Uh-oh. Uh, sir? Sir? Yeah! Wake up! Ouch! Yeah, what are you doing? Well, I just want to talk to you, man. I just want to say hi. How are you? How are the kids? How's the fam? Oh, good heavens, I was wondering what this was. It seems it's a huge tuna. I'm not a tuna, I'm a whale. And I have problems. It feels like something's jumping around in my belly. Uh, help me. 
I say, oh boy, this great tuna seems to have a bit of a bellyache. Mario, what say you lend the fish a hand, hmm? Uh, I told you I'm not a tuna. I'm not even a fish. <laughs> I have a headache from your jumping around on me. Do you think you could check my belly? I will absolutely check your belly. Come here, Mr. Big Tuna. Or Big, you know, whatever. Oh, well, I will uh, light up the way here using what? Uh, let's see here. Okay, so that's the first part of it here. Oh! Wah! Hoonan! What you think you're doing with that light? Okay. Uh... Sir? 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 Excuse me. Please? There we go. Okay. I have no idea what this thing is. Hey, fella. You want a piece of this? You got it. I'm ornery as... I'm or... I'm ornery? As all get out. Prepare for some pain. Okay. I have never seen the likes of you in any other Mario game ever. So, hey, that's fine. I will use the power of light against you. There we go. Get electrified, buddy. And, ooh, you took my jump ability? Ooh. Now, that's a bit, that's a bit much. Okay, I'm going to use... Uh, this, I'm using PK Star Storm on you, as any good uh, Samaritan would, after eliminating my jump ability, one of the only abilities I can actually use here. Great, awesome. Uh, can I take you down from the sky, or the ceiling, rather? There we go. It does one damage? Ouch. That stinks. All right. Uh, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Nope, I'm blocking that. <laughs> I love how he has no expression. He's like... He's not even mad. He's just like, really? Really? Okay. PK Starstorm! Where's Ness and Lucas? Where are they? Doesn't matter. Oh, he's dead. Cool. Well, that wasn't too hard. Uh, 16 star points for us, so that brings us up to 26. Aw. Shucks. First, I think I get away with that old fishing man, and then I get all swallowed up by some huge fish. And then this fella's with my mustache goes upside my head. I've just been falling out of frying pans and f fires since I was just a grub. Talk about a lousy lot in life. Mario, it's me. You know the whale, can you hear me? That stomach seems to have cleared right up. I feel fantastic. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we're made of paper. That's not good. Whoosh! And they all get squirted out the top. There they go. A little fuzzball. Hey, it's you, boy. You're that dumb old fish that ate me up all and such. You plum idiot. You know I thought it was a goner for sure. Uh, I'm awfully sorry. I was just having a nap with my mouth open. Well, I suppose I can see my way to forgiving you this time, but you just watch it. I reckon I owe you some thanks after all, Mr. Mustache. I'll take care now. And he hops off into the distance, never to be seen again. I feel <laughs> I feel much better now. I should call you Dr. Mario. Well, as a matter of fact... um. I've got it. I, the tuna, am, I mean, I, the whale, am good at swimming. So basically, he will take us to the island, the lava lava island, I, 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 in the lava lava island. That's where we're gonna go. So, uh, sir, could we please? What am I supposed to do? I do want to go to lava lava island. Thank you very much. After a brief, uh, encounter in the very beginning there, uh, with the blooper. We are now on our way to the next of the crystal stars. It is going to be uh, a rough journey over there. Lots of rough seas, apparently, because riding a big tuna. <laughs> that seagull looks so dead. It's just like... Like, expressionless. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a taxidermied seagull is just flying around in the ocean. Hot, hot times on Lava Lava Island. Cool. Mm. I think this is also another place you can get another whack a bump. So that's pretty cool. I think there's one over uh, here somewhere in this first area. If you want me to take you back to Toad Town, just ask. Cool. So, uh, yeah, you need to go solve the uh, mystery of Lava Lava Island. Uh, I don't know how tropical it actually ends up being here. Ooh, that's a heart. Cool. Not that I needed it super badly, but yeah. Nice. 
Uh, that will launch me into the sky, it seems like. Or no. That's the Wii U menu. I don't want to do that. There we go. We press the uh, Z button. That's how you take care of that. Okay. I forgot which button it actually was. All right. Ooh, there's something over here. What's this? That's a stopwatch. Do I really care about that? Ah, uh, not really. Okay, I'm going to leave that there. Um, being frozen in time, not as helpful as you may think. So maybe there is no um, thing here. Uh, whack a bump. I thought there was, but hey, whatever. Yay! I say help. Help, I say. How? How? Let's see. There's a letter. Oh, hi, you. Uh, before I go and deal with that fuzzy, I'm going to take this letter that just so precariously landed up top there. I'm going to take it down this fuzzy and... Nope. Really? Come on. Hit it with the hammer. No. Okay. Yes. There we go. Tried to get the first strike on it, but clearly that didn't work. So, I didn't mean to do that one. I meant to do the other one. Oops. Okay. Well, I'll just go for this first. And they are going to take probably HP and FP. So, not going to be a great time here. Uh-oh. Yep. Okay. Rapidly tap A to prevent them from taking more stuff. They're probably going to get away with one no matter what. Yeah, they are. So, you can, you can dodge at least a little bit there. And, uh, yeah. Because you can probably let them keep going and going like a whole bunch. But, yeah. So... These fuzzies, now at this point, are going to be a lot to deal with. Even though they only do two for uh, star points that we actually get out of them. So, they are annoying and they don't net out a lot of actual experience either. So, what a great combination, you know? And they must have a pretty high defense because the electro move here and the hammer only does six. Or oh, that did four. So, that's good. And we're up to 30 now. So, Mr. Colorado can be safe and sound. Hey, buddy. You're good. Ah, uh, phew, you, you saved me. Oh, chum. Let's get ourselves out of here now. So he's basically kind of like a partner, except not following you. And you have to follow him around to make sure that he doesn't hurt himself. So, well, there's a Yoshi village. I kind of forgot that the Yoshis had their own village. Sort of a deal. But they definitely do. So, uh, yeah. Uh, let's check out what's... A oh, are you the, the lead Yoshi here? Because you got a feather in your the hat. A head scale. I don't know. I'm the leader of the Yoshi village. Ah, uh, you come seeking. You wish to go to Mount Lava Lava, do you? Hmm. The entrance to the volcano is in the jungle, but it's very difficult to get to it. The volcano has awakened as well. I think it may be too dangerous for you to go there. Well, you can sit on your fat butt and eat all the stuff you want, because I, uh, I'm gonna keep on going. Hi, guys. What's up? Ka. What an enticing piece of dialogue. Caw? Are you the Mario that Master Raphael the Raven was telling us about? Oracle of the Stars, Mario comes to this island. Mario is fated to meet Master Raphael Raven. Caw? Caw, caw? Oh, anyways, alright. Enough of that. Enough of all that. Excuse me. Hey, buddy. Oh, it's so rare to have visitors these days. I'd love to stop and chat, but I have my fishful... Um, I'm watching these naughty boys who are very, very naughty, so they don't do anything dangerous. I can't prove it yet, but I bet they're planning something. Well, if you think they can fool sushi, they better think again. Okay. So, we'll leave him there for now. Uh, clearly that is, uh, Sushi, who is going to be our next partner. The one that can help us navigate water. But I think the, uh, the Yoshi boys here might have something to say about it, you know. We gotta do a little quest for them, I guess, at some point. I don't know. But, uh, we'll make our way through the jungle first. Yeah, again? Really? Okay. Well, I'm gonna switch to Bombette, or, yeah, Bombette, because she's got the power. So, oh, a shy guy. Hey, buddy. Get out of here. I love how he was still hitting him, even though I, uh, I made it so. I, uh, you know, like, did the first strike. But, hey, whatever. That's fine. Okay, I'm going to go for this. I'm going to see how much damage these guys actually do. I could have eliminated them in one shot, but that would be too easy. And, okay, so two damage. Not too bad. All right, I'll go for the standard jump here. There we go. Is that enough to do it? Yes, it is. And another two XP. Yay. Or, or two XP each, I should say. Yeah, there we go. Uh, you saved me once more. It's almost like this is going to be a reoccurring thing. Who would have figured, right? Anyways, uh, is there any more enemies? No, there's not. Oh, hi. Ah, Mario. Have a look at this. There's no bridge. 
that's a problem. Looks like the entrance to the volcano, eh, hole boy? Well, it certainly doesn't look like the entrance to the, you know, the IRS. Or like, or like the state house or something, you know? It doesn't look like the entrance to the nether. Like, all three evil places right there, all right in a row. Alright, so we'll make our way back over this way. And uh, make sure Colorado doesn't get jumped again. He's getting jumped again. Are you serious? Come on. For the third t Okay. <laughs> Did you think I was beset by enemies again, old boy? It's just a bit of a joke. Does it look like a joke to me? Sir, I am protecting you. I am your, your safety captain. Okay? Don't mess around. Uh-oh. There is trouble afoot. Why are you crying? Sir, oh, such ill fortune. The children are missing. They seem to have secretly slipped off into the jungle. They don't know what's dangerous. How did you let... Like, how did you lose your children? It's not like they're, like, perusing around a Walmart or something. But you can find them, you know? I swear, all these natives are so panicky that we can't get any information. I guess someone had better solve their problems so we can quiz them, eh, old boy? Well, that looks like it's going to be a me problem. So, uh, I don't know where Sushi is. But uh, he's the one we got to talk to here. Um, maybe back in the actual village or up top. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Uh, where is Mr. Sushi? Uh, Professor Sushi. Are you asleep? Oh, Mario, please. Oh, okay. He looked like he was asleep. <laughs> that would have been funny. I forgot you could do that. You can part the, the bush there. The bushes. You little ingrates. Oh, there's our final one there. I, I want that flower really badly. I'll look up here if you can hear me. Oh, hey, sushi. You're not acting like a sushi. You're not on a platter. Aki, uh, help me out. Uh, no, actually. Come on now, try harder. Hey, man, listen. You were stuck in the tree in the first place. You're asking for my help. I feel like one big ache. Thanks for getting me. Uh, hey, so... Uh, you want to come with us to, uh, save those kids? Well, so, you're looking for those little rascals as well? Yeah, uh, we just want information. So, uh, whatever it takes to get there. But, uh, yeah. Uh, want to help? I'll Mario Ha- Well, I've never heard of you before. You must be from far away or something. Enjoy lovely, lovely Lava Lava Island. I'd usually say to a visitor anyway, but... First, can you help me find these boys? Yes, I certainly will. If you can help me get to that flower that's right over there, too, you know, that would be... Uh, incredibly useful as well. So, uh, yeah, now if you go up to one of these docks right here, you can use uh, Sushi's ability, which uh, is to not only uh, swim in the water, but then duck under certain things as well. So, uh, yeah, we'll grab this star piece here. And hopefully by the next episode, I'll figure out where exactly I can spend the star bits and whatnot. But yeah, or the star pieces, I should say. Hey, excuse me. Um, yo, what's up? Thanks for waking me up. This island's so nice, isn't it? It's a perfect place for napping. Perfect temperature. I'm Bobub. My job is to fill this world with flowers. I want you to take this seed. Or rather, that's what I want to say to you. Unfortunately, the seed isn't quite ready yet. Oh, don't worry, though. It'll be ready any time now. Waiting for such a warm, comfy place can't all be bad, right? You can grab the seed later. Interesting. Okay. So maybe after I complete the, the chapter, we can grab the seed from there. But maybe it's also a, a, sto a story situation... You know, you got to reach a certain point of the story in order to uh, make a certain thing happen. Obviously, that happens a ton of the time, too. So, now that this is the only thing left in here, it'll be uh, a bit easier to keep track of. So, that's good. But now we can properly explore the jungle and where to go and whatnot. I definitely want whatever badge is inside of here. And I hear someone snoring. I don't know who, but okay. Okay.